everyone i'm kimmy cute and welcome to my channel now in today's video we're going to talk about everything that you'd need as a beginner music if you're interested keep watching Okay, so the first thing that you're going to need are nails. Nails, nails, nails. So these are the nails that I use on a regular. You can use any nails that you want, but these are the ones that I love. These are no curve, clear, XX, cutout nails, right? These, I'm gonna show you what it looks like. So this is what, this is what it looks like. I don't know if you can see properly. But this is what it looks like. It doesn't have a deep curve, so I like this one and it's cut out. So it's just easier to work with. So I like this one. So of course, when you have your nails, you're going to need something to put the nails on. So you're going to need glue. Now you can use any nail glue. It doesn't matter the brand. You can use any nail glue. And then you're going to need an emery board. Can be anyone. But I prefer the 100 by 100 nail files. And then after that you're going to need a nail cutter now you, some people use nail clip uh, they use what's this called again nipper yes they use a nipper but I prefer to use the nail cutter because it's just easier and can get to you know push the finger the nail all the way through when you choose the length that you want so I prefer to use a nail cutter okay so we have nails we have our nails, we have our emery board, and we have our cut off, and we have our glue. So after that, you're definitely going to need a nail drill. Definitely going to need a nail drill, right? This is, it's called an electric file, but I call it a nail drill. So you need that one, and then you're going to need your acrylic brush, okay? This is a Kalinsky German size 14 acrylic brush. And of course, going along with acrylic, we're going to need an acrylic powder. You can use any one you want. And acrylic liquid, okay? Preferably if you use the same brand. It works better if you use the same brand. And you're going to need acetone in order to clean your brush and wipe off any mistake that you make. Acetone can do a lot of things. And you're going to need a gel polish. Preferably, Kimmy Cute Nails Gel Polish. Okay, and then you're going to need a top coat as well. Because of course, with the gel polish, you're going to need a gel top coat to put over it. To let your work look nice and shiny. And of course, not forgetting, you definitely need to get yourself one of these nail art brushes. Right? It's five of them in it but it's actually 10 brushes that comes in it because it's double end and I'm going to show you what I mean. So here we have the nail art brushes, right? And it looks like this. So we have two ends. Okay, can you see it? I hope you can see it. So you have the logo in the middle and then you have the two brushes on each end and it's like that for all five so you end up with like 10 brushes also you need a buffer to smooth out your acrylic after you do your acrylic application and then of course you're going to need a cuticle pusher this you'll use at the beginning when you're doing your prep work and also your nipple so you can't forget these guys and you also need to have different types of drill bit now remember earlier we said that you're going to need a drill you're definitely going to need drill bits so you need a sanding band to take away all the shine from the natural nail you also need a tornado bit right so this is for to go within the cuticle area to make it flush with the natural nail and you can also get it's not a must but i will say that you need to 
But if you don't have it, it's fine. This is called a cuticle bit. Some people call it like a diamond bit, but I call it a cuticle bit. So you go around the cuticle and take away everything, you know, it makes for a good preparation, good foundation, but acrylic to sit on. And I think that's, that's it. Oh no, you definitely need a dust brush. So whenever you get all these acrylic, you know, on you and on your table and you need a dust brush to dust off the plants, a nice a cute one yes and of course guys you cannot forget the main thing you are going to need a uv lamp or a led lamp but yeah i think i think that's it yeah that's it <laughs> for all the products that i listed before i'm gonna tell you like where if i remember because i don't almost remember right but i'll try my best to remember where i got all of these from so I'm gonna start with this. You can get this at any local beauty supply store. It's called a buff up, right? With the nail drill bits, I got most of them from Amazon. So you can just check out Amazon for the nail drill bits. And for the drill, I also got my drill from Amazon, but I do not remember the name of the drill. So yeah. And for the acrylic powder, you can get it at any nail supply store. Along with your nail glue, any nail supply store as well for the Kim and Q nail art brushes you can you can DM me on Instagram or you can comment below if you're interested and I'll get back to you and for the acrylic brush any nail supply store as well or you can order it from Amazon Amazon has these as well everything I said actually you can get from Amazon apart from Kim and Q nail products you have to DM me for those Emery board, Amazon. Nail clipper, Amazon. Cuticle, for sure you can get it from any of your nail supply store, just the same. And your dust brush, you can get it from Amazon as well. Cutter, you can get this from your local nail supply store, as well as your top coat, your nails. If you want acrylic liquid, you can get that from your local nail supply store as well. But for the Kimmy Cute nail gel polish, you have to DM me for these nail polishes. Okay? And for the five piece nail art set. <laughs> okay. So if you don't remember everything that I've listed before, I'm going to leave it in the description box below. But as it relates to the nail polishes and the nail art brushes, you need to DM me on Instagram at Kimmy Cute Nails. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell at the side and like and share my content, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.